everybody, how's it going? And uh, in the background behind me, Bittern is uh, having a little break in, as you can see right here. So right now I am in the middle of unboxing um, Bittern in a, in a separate video. I'll uh, put up a link up here so that way you, you can see it. So <clears throat> I do apologize if that video sounds, you know, if I sound terrible in that video. Not that I'm sick or anything, it's just that none of my unboxing, unboxings are script and all that. Uh, but yeah, Otis, you want to say hi to the camera? You want to say hi to YouTube? I guess not. <laughs> He's my grandparents' dog, by the way. So in today's video, I'm, uh, while, while Bittern is uh, running in, I'm actually going to uh, put Mallard uh, hauling that uh, auxiliary water tender that Bittern came with. I'm really excited about this. I've been wanting to try it out since Bittern was coming in through the mail. So yeah, um, let's get to it, shall we? He just let out a yawn there, didn't he? Now look at that, you want to say hi now, don't you? Yeah, he was the dog you've been hearing um, in the previous video. <laughs> alright, not now, Otis. Alright, can you get off me, please? Otis, alright. Yeah, he wanted to be carried. Alright. So Mallard is in here. I'm going to have to hold her and the tender together since she's permanently connected electrically. Yeah, there she is. All right, now let's put on track with that water tender. Yeah, even though it has happened with Bittern, I really want to see what Mallard looked like with the auxiliary water tender. So, yeah, sort of a bit of a random video, but uh, I really want to do it nonetheless. So, yeah, let me move the camera back. All right, there's Mallard in all of its glory. I'll hook up the water tender with her. And check that out. That is Mallard with the water tender. There we go. I don't know why it looks so far apart. Yes, Mallard doesn't have a cord or tender. I guess that's why that explains a big gap. But hey, you know, it still looks good. All right, let's give her a little test run. Still looks really good. All right, Bitter and Tad, like maybe half an hour of running. Let's slow it down. Put it in reverse. Let me get used to running. All right. Still in the middle of the filming, unboxing this, like I just said, but yeah, I don't want to get too fast. There we go, it's pretty good after breaking in the reverse. Yeah. I'm sorry for the GD1 and the T1 being there. I really wanted the place to put that rolling road so Bittern can have a, um, a break in, but yeah. Pretty random idea, isn't it? But I love it. I really love it. Even if it's not accurate. Trying to get my attention? Huh? How are you? Okay then. Alright, I'm gonna stop Mallard here. There we go. Alright. Now let's hook it up to some coaches, shall we? We'll move up. Now it up slightly, slightly. <laughs> yeah, alright, there we go. Now let's look it up to some coaches. Alright, the coaches are right here. Now let's get Mallard to back up to them with that auxiliary tender she's borrowing, let's say. Alright. I know Mallard doesn't have a corridor tender, but hey, it still looks good. <laughs> okay. Now let's take Mallard off. Ooh, good wheel slip there, eh? But she's doing it. She is absolutely doing it. 
I'm gonna do a bit of a high speed. Gosh, he's really well something. Mallory may not weigh very much, but she's doing it. She's really loose looking now. I can see the wheel just spinning like mad. Probably should have kept one or two out, but I wanted to put all six on. Oh well. Yeah, I won't be doing it too long in case it puts a bit of strain in the motor. But I'll give it about um, maybe one or two more laps. So what do you think about Mallory having an auxiliary water tender? Pretty strange, eh? I think it might be a little strange too. I might agree with you there. Alright, I'll give old Mallory a brace since that, that wheel slip was pretty much torturing her a little bit. <laughs> that was pretty fun to, uh, to film though. So, thank you guys so much for watching this random idea of a video. And I will see you guys next time. Take care everybody. And I'll finish uh, unbox doing the... I will finish filming the unboxing of Bittern in the 1-1 collection. There we go. That is much better to say.